What, what is this? Here we have Marco Delegato, known for dying brutally every game he's ever been in. But this time he goes first, so he can't possibly die. Oh, and he got a good hold of that goat. Here we have also another Ooh. round. Magnificent riding of the hearse. Here we have the space round, but also men cannot be in the in the gap area. If they do, they will be eliminated. The gap area, of course, very dangerous. I've lost many, many great players to the gap area. Harner Torres, cat on his head, unperturbed. <clears throat> I've, I've never been much of a fan of people putting cats on their heads, I must say. This is a danger to the animal. Don't do that at home. The animal yes. is, of course, the human. Of course, this one has the space gravity option. So, will Germany take advantage of this? Many years ago, the first man to reach space, of course, did it climbing off the back of famous Norwegian player Sleslek. Famous. Oh, <laughs> Ulysses yes. Javier is a man of many qualities entrepreneur ceo president of the united states but will he be able to mount his friends we'll see in 44 seconds in fact all of those accomplishments means nothing in the, the game of mounting your friends <clears throat> making sky high irving de garmo Obviously dead. No idea why he's in the game. Should be buried long time ago. <laughs> you know, some people just won't quit. Using his skeleton body to climb up these friends. The skeleton body, of oh, course, no! there was some debate whether it should be banned for the giving you an unfair advantage, clearly. Irving not enough Degarmo, of an advantage. Not doing that well, not showing a great sign for Team Swede. He appears Maybe. to be dabbing, or crying. <laughs> Maybe both. 25 seconds. Will this be the end for Team Swede? If Irving DeGarmo is unable, should have stayed, stayed dead, but Hubris takes a man too far. Oh, but it looks like he is making it. And brilliant. Mm, and a truly comeback. inspiring display. Ah, Valentine Doty. Of course, had a controversy last year when he said smoking is good for you to a room full of children. <laughs> what? He was brought yeah. on for a for a show and tell on smoking, on how you should not. He misinterpreted the message, being an <laughs> avid smoker himself. He's on at least five packs a day, I hear. Damn, that's one hell of a smoker. He just says he can't get enough of the smooth, refined taste. Whether or not that's because of his deal with the tobacco company, we cannot know. Phil Omit, of course, knowing for being a champion, for having no friends, here in Mount Your Friends to make some connections. Yes, we'll see if he can rub up and get, rub people the right way. Of course, no one on his team likes him. They say the sport is now Mount Your Acquaintances in his presence. <laughs> Just so they don't have to hang out with him after work. Truly his teammates a sad are, little man. His teammates are known saying that his cock shit moves awkwardly. <laughs> it's a bit bent. Oh. Uh, here we have Biao Bio Bell. Here we have Be here we have B here we have here we have B here here we have B here we have Bayou here be, uh, here we have B. Here we have uh, here we have B. B here B. B. E. B. E. B. U. 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 B. B. U. 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 Here we have author Jody, not much of an author, has never learned never learned how to write. He is, well, of course, at... not really an author, thus making him not much of one. Shameful to display. <sighs> it seems that he has problems with his arms. Ah, oh, shit. Often, very bad thing oh. to have in this sport, a problem with your arms. Do you remember that player who came in last year who had no arms and no legs? He didn't yeah. get very far. 
Yeah, that's uh, quite hard to mount your friends. <sighs> of course, the torso-only league is picking up steam in some smaller countries where people don't have as many limbs, they just can't afford them. But we'll see how far that sport gets. And yes, and some people say, claim that even if they use prosthetic, they can't. They're not real climbers. Hmm. Oh, Glen Amber! Quite a controversial boy. In fact, known for stealing a chocolate bar. He's been in prison for most of his life for stealing that chocolate bar, <laughs> but he's been let out and try finally uh, <laughs> confronting his dream of mounting a bunch of of men with their cocks dangling everywhere. Exactly. And he couldn't be happier. Ooh! Clint. The the traditional grab your cock for move. Very Clint, nice. Clint Abner is also related to Jessica Abner, who is the world champion eating the most butter. I can't believe I can't imagine eating that much butter. Ah, uh, <laughs> Terrace essays. A complete newcomer. No one knows anything about him, and he's not interesting. <laughs> Look at him! He looks like a Pikachu! <laughs> and he's not interesting. <laughs> Many a fan art has been drawn of him, but it is unsure is of Pikachu or Terence's eyes. Terence's Could eyes, be... of course, claims it is him and has sued the Nintendo company on numerous occasions, often successfully. Oh, Reggie feels in me has been quoted to say, I hate Terrence. <laughs> Down from his friends when he's mounting them. Of course, but there I... was a petition online called Kill Terrace Assize, which got 127 <laughs> signed names. Now that's just unfair, fact, to boy. One of the one of the contestants in this game coming up is one of the persons who put in his name in that peti pe petition. It's a bit worrying that a sniper rifle was found on his person, but was removed. Yes, but it's not Boy Slazal, also known as the Happy Boy. Because he's always angry. Especially angry at his eyes. <laughs> exactly. But as you can see, he's one hell he's of a climber. He's making his way up there. It looks like he plans on killing his eyes as soon as... <laughs> People do make it to the top. Will the he police, manage this? The police are coming right now, but they've been asked not to interfere with the pile. In fact, you know, they tried to remove one person Here from he pile is, one. and it looks like he has killed them. Here is police officer Josiah Urata allowed into the game to arrest whoever the fuck that was on the condition that he partakes. In the game of Mount Your Friends. So we got a complete Rada. amateur here. Yeah, but he's doing pretty well. Jashaya Uruda is known for solving the crime of the 500 murderer man. Committed 400 murders. Of course, we all remember that you lying. can't remove a man from a pile once he's stuck. Because that happened once in 1988. And by God, we still feel the aftershocks of that w uh, crash. If you see his tongue out, that is not his facial expression, but that is a severe defect of his face. Oh, and he has he put goes, his hands on he him. He has arrested him. <laughs> but he cannot take him to the court until the game is over. Ah, here's the man who put Raya's name on that uh, petition. As Otis we know... Adamus, otherwise known as Shaky Knees. Otis Adams is actually uh, a part of the family that is most known for declawing all of the Mount Your Friends. As we know, pre the decree of evil god Asmile, when you are mounted by your friends, you cannot be moved. Only via crowbar. Of course, <laughs> that was a very, very illegal tactic. Back in the old days when Mount Your Friends was an Olympic sport before it got removed by the committee, many players, many countries would manufacture small hidden crowbars that could be secreted on one's person to be snuck into the game. This practice oh, has since it. died. 
Ah, Javier, Xavier, Costelen, Costelnik. Savior. A name that's very hard to say by me. But, yeah, yeah, he's a veteran climber, in fact. Just not that mm. interesting. Known for kissing all his friends when he touches them. He has been sued many, many <laughs> times for harassment. But he has never been convicted, funny enough. But in this last year, he's really got his head in the game. He only kisses them post-game now. They don't like it either, he's still getting sued. But it... <laughs> it seems that he ha has a bit of trouble. Ah. He still has that kiss face on though, it's the face of a man who knows he's going to the top. Literally. <laughs> oh. Or is he? Ah oh, shit. There's what? so many buttons. <laughs> <laughs> There's it at seems least that he has problems problem controlling his limbs. Ah, uh, shit, I'm not gonna make it, guys. Ah! And he did not, but he did a fine landing. Christopher Chris Bungie. Christopher Bungie, of course, naming himself after infamous video game company Bungie, but fucking up and writing it wrong. Truly, his, his life is a disaster. His family <laughs> disowned him after he renamed himself... For some reason, he also put a K instead of a C in his name. His family truly hates him. They think he is a pretentious asshole. Well, you know what they say. Pretentious assholes tend to be awful. Of course, he was known for saying last year Destiny 2 will be good. He's wrong about many things, and that was a doozy. Especially well, wrong he... about his name. In fact, Bungie has decided to sue him for libel and being an embarrassing fan. <laughs> well, let's see now if he can make it up with his climbing skills. Oh, Of oh course, my. Christopher Bungie is doing this for his idol, Master Chief. Ah, uh, Master Chief. Also known as Halo. Eugene uh... Datilo is making his way up, rubbing his cock on every person. He's got that A, that S and D. He's gotta let go of that A if he's gonna make it any thirder. But he needs to place that S. Oh, his sticky hands are sticking to everything. His family is quoted as saying, fucking Eugene, he's always sticking to everything. He's known for getting stuck on the toilet and he unable to detach himself. In fact, they needed to use an axe to get him out of there. Allegations last year of being told to throw a match by the Mafia were unsubstantiated yet true. Eugenio Datilo, of course, is 900 years old. So he has a lot to live up to, but it seems like... Oh, he, he did, did it. it! Quite a beautiful stretch. Art Jasonovsky... <laughs> Known for having the dumbest name in this game, possibly. But we'll see what the future holds. If there is... even will be a future, because uh, the mount has gotten rather, rather large. And here is a word from our sponsor. Our sponsor is Squarespace. Do you want to make your own mount your friends? <gasps> oh my! An upset has happened. An upset has happened, and the ad has been postponed because of that. But we're going back to the ad as soon as possible. Art Jasonovsky, of course, is known oh, for have... pissing on all of his teammates as he climbs up. <laughs> oh, we have a word from our sponsors? Uh, yeah, it's from Squarespace. If you want to make a fan page to one of your favorite mounters, um, here's your not... coupon Oh, code. it seems that Jasonovsky has cost us the, the sponsorship. Yes, he has. Ah, Jesse, Jason Nowski, you fuck. <laughs> He's gonna get so kicked. I've just got word that Art has been disowned from his family. They're disgraced. <laughs> ah, shameful day. We'll see if he commits mounting Sudoku. 